being a spiritual person simply means whatever affects people in the physical, I'm not supposed to be a victim. But unfortunately, you don't just wake up to become a spiritual person. You are supposed to follow. It's a journey. You can begin as a nobody today, but you can continue and grow in the spiritual realm. Yes, the same way that when you go to the gym, you take your weights. And the more you take the weight, you begin to increase in muscles. In the same way that as a spiritual person, your fasting, your prayers, reading the word of God. As a matter of fact, always reading your Psalms, eating the Holy Communion, doing what you're supposed to do. It increases you and empowers you. Because everybody that can ever make, in, make it in life or make a mark in life is a spiritual person. Whilst you are moving up and down, shaking off a person's hand only can be a spiritual exchange. You can shake somebody's hand, give me your hand right now, protocol, and it can be an exchange. A human being can just stand on a place and another human being can take soil from that place and that will be the end of the human being. But if I can stand some place for another to take soil from my feet for something bad to happen to me, then I can also take my own soil from Jesus. under my feet and I will declare blessings over my destiny. Yes. Every big thing that happened in the Bible was supernatural. Red Sea being opened is supernatural. After Moses opened the Red Sea through the road, another guy by the name of Joshua showed up and said, I'm not confronting the Red Sea, I'm confronting the Jordan. But for me, when I see the Jordan, I don't need a stick. What I need is my feet. When Joshua confronted the Jordan, he didn't need a stick to open the Jordan. The Bible says, and he stepped his foot at the edge. And the Bible says, and the Jordan got open. Some of you, you want to move in life with a, with a rod, but I, some of us, we want to move in life with our feet. Uh. That anywhere we stand, something will be open. Jesus. I came to introduce you to a Joshua generation. Yes, Where in the place that looks very impossible, Jesus. when your feet stands in that place, yes, because you're a supernatural person, Jesus. that thing begins to open. Amen.